Hi guys, so I'm gonna do a little vlog for you. Today is Sunday and uh, I just got ready, filmed two videos. I filmed my favorites and empties, so I'm like exhausted <laughs> from talking so much and also because I'm quite hungry. I feel like my tongue is getting twisted, so yeah, I'm gonna go downstairs and have something to eat. Probably a salad or something, something quick before I go out because I'm gonna go to Acropolis. I'm gonna take you guys along. And I've just been watching um, some vlog videos from Sunbeam's Jess. Jessica, I just love her vlog so much and uh, she started doing Vlogtober. So I'm absolutely loving her vlog videos. I, I, I could listen to her talk for hours and hours. She has the most soothing voice ever. There's something about it, like the the sound and like, I don't know, just, just the sound. It makes me feel like calm and at peace and it's so comforting literally I could listen to her for hours and hours so um and she's a very interesting person she studies english literature at edinburgh it made me miss studying and i never thought i would say that i did study english literature as well so after reading a book we would have a discussion in class i really miss those times so watching her vlogs kind of reminds me of being a student and i love how motivated she is and like she's so interesting and intelligent and I just love her vlog so I'm gonna leave um, the link to her channel down below for you guys you should definitely check her out and um, what else can I just oh I can show you my new bed sheets aren't these beautiful I just love them these are like satin floral bed sheets I just love them I love flowers so and also my new rug that I got quite recently so it's all very floral and look, I have two huge pillows. So it's like I'm sleeping like a princess in my bed of flowers. Yesterday I actually was trying to sort out my bookcase because you guys know that I used to keep my shoes here. But you know, summer is over. I checked away all my heels and ballerinas and whatnot into the attic and I thought, well, I don't know. I don't feel like displaying my shoes anymore here. So... I decided to use the bookshelf for what it's meant to be used for and I tried to organize my books in a nice way and I need to get some more decorations and whatnot so yeah these are some of the books and I really like how it looks so far and here are the empties that I just filmed bag full of empties so I'm gonna throw these away should probably turn on the heating because it's so freaking cold already like my hands are icy cold i think this corner looks a bit neater because i had a bunch of books stacked on my table and it just like it, it wouldn't fit anymore so now i only have some shakespeare books and harry potter on my desk and um yeah i'm gonna move all of my books here i have the rest of them there um so yeah, that's that. I'm loving this lip liner. It's Beige Anu by L'Oreal. Isn't it amazing? Like every time I wear it, I'm like, how beautiful is this lip liner? It's this one, Beige Anu. It doesn't come with a gold lid. It comes with a clear one, but I just put a gold one from a, another product. Um, yeah, I love it so much. It's very long lasting and the color is so beautiful. I'm wearing my Zara gray jumper, my CCM jewelry. And uh, I think I'm just gonna wear my Lindex cape today because it's nice and snug and it's like walking with a blanket. I love it so much. And yeah, I'm gonna eat, get ready, I mean get dressed and I'm gonna go because it's already like 4 in the afternoon and why do I always get out of the house so late? Should I have gotten out a bit earlier? So that's my outfit for today guys, just the exact same outfit I wore in Paris. Um, this grey Zara jumper, my Lindex cape, which I love, um, mango black skinny jeans, and then my Michael Kors mirror handbag. I curled my hair today, so yeah, that's my look, very like, relaxed and bohemian and cozy all at the same time. And for perfume today, I'm wearing my um, Diptyque Eau Duel, which is a spice of vanilla, perfect for this kind of weather when it's quite chilly so it's you know a cozy vanilla -y fragrance
that's a small caramel macchiato. Never tried it before, it's pretty good. Ooh, we have some night products here. Some bath salts. I'm in manga now. We'll try these jackets. Suede jackets in khaki in this kind of wine color. I'm gonna try this wool blend jumper. And this is a cashmere blend jumper. I like soft beige colors. I love the color, but I think it's a bit too long. It's supposed to be long, but I don't know. It's really warm. The jacket looks really bad on me. Not feeling it at all. I think it looks quite bad. That's why it's on sale. I'm very stiff. This jumper is lovely. It's super soft. I mean, it's a cashmere blend, so it's super soft. It's like an oatmeal color. I like it. I'm in Stradivarius now. We'll try a similar jacket. Another suede bomber. This one looks very nice, I think. I like the gold details. The price is the same. With a big scarf around, it look cool. And it's like very structured. I'm used to wearing like shapeless clothing. I think it's quite nice. Very Rosie Huntington whitely. surprise I found so many items found this like coffee with cream kind of simple jumper and this one this one is quite long so I'm not sure about it this one all the colors are pretty much the same but that's, these are the colors that I love on this fluffy white uh, scarf that looks lovely and this jumper for only 10 euros I thought for wearing around the house and this coat I tried it before I really like it but I wish the color was more like that um, it's a bit you know it's a bit dark this jumper it's like an oatmeal color these like sweat pants or like yoga pants to wear around the house so I'm gonna try everything on now. Oh, I love this jumper it's so cozy and I like this color it's like a rosy nude I think I should get it. The bottom is really lovely. I really like the neckline. Just a nice cozy jumper. No, makes me look like a potato sack. So that's the coat. What do you guys think? I love the bathrobe design, but I think the color is just not very mean. It's like too dark. The model is so elegant. Love these yoga pants. They're so soft and comfy. And quite flattering on the bummers. I think. Cute and comfy outfit for lounging around the house. Good shopping. 
I would so get this, but I know that Louis will never sleep on it. These are so cute. But Louis would never get in. I love these bed sheets. I bought mine here. These are beautiful too. I'm just browsing. This look fancy. Oh, new collection of cozy socks. These are cute. These are so fluffy. I have these from last year. They're really nice and warm. These are cute. Oh, so squishy. I don't know, I want them all. It's so good to just lay down because I did quite a bit of walking, so good to relax. And the reason I went out is because I'm home alone. My family is away on holiday. My um, brother just left for Vilnius for studying this afternoon. My aunt and my cousin Linda are in Vilnius. My granny is going to Vilnius tomorrow. My cousin Daiva is sick. My boyfriend was away fishing in Etreta, you know, the place where we went with the mountains and stuff. So I was like literally just left alone in the house with two cats. And I was like, I don't know, I don't want to stay home alone. So I thought I'm gonna go out. And also it's just like it gets dark so quickly. And my brother started teasing me about like supernatural stuff. He got to Vilnius and he texted me saying like, be beware of the dark figures in your room at night, blah blah blah. And I'm, I was like, shut up, it's not funny. So I'm not sure how I'm gonna sleep tonight. If I'm not gonna get spooked. Hopefully not. Um, I will have Louis to keep me company. And yeah, I wasn't really into like buying anything fashion related. I wanted to browse while I needed some wintry, like cozy jumpers. And... Um, what I got is not fashion related, it's just like comforting stuff. So food, a book, loungewear, I think that's pretty much it. So I'm gonna show you guys what I got. By the time you're watching this vlog, everyone will be back, like my family will be all reunited because I have tons of videos that will go before this vlog. So by the time this goes, everyone will be back and I won't be home alone. Um, yeah, my boyfriend is back from fishing, so I'm gonna Skype with him tonight, but now I'm just gonna show you what I got. Louis is very curious. He's like circling the bags already. Wait, I think I'm gonna just bring these bags on to my bed. Yeah. Oh my god, seriously? I didn't intend on buying anything. Oh yeah, and bath products. That was another thing I didn't mention. So I went to H&M and you guys saw in the video. So I got this jumper that I showed you. It's a beautiful color. Um, it's like dusty rose mixed with nude. You cannot really tell the color in this light. Yeah, I thought it's a nice jumper. It is a bit long for my liking. I wish it was shorter. It does cover your bum, but then it's nice. You can wear it with leggings. Louis! She's eating a baguette. <laughs> oh my god. So this one was $19.99. I got this sweatshirt with cats. Because you guys know my love for cats. Hence this one. Uh, and this one was only $9.99. Such a good price for um, um, like a home loungewear. You could wear this out, I suppose. But to me, it's just like a homeware. Um, and then I got these. Like... Um, yoga pants. These are really really soft and the material is really thin but I love that it, it doesn't really have like a waistband that tucks into your tummy so it's like really nice and soft around your like um, tummy area and just, I just love these. And these were $14.99. So I got like these big cotton pads to remove my makeup and then in Drogas I also repurchased my Dove um, nourishing hair mask, the gold one which is my favorite hair mask ever. I got 
two knife products. They started selling these in uh, Drogas and also in Maxima. Knife, uh, these are German products and I love them. So this is bath oil, mandarin and orange. Uh, Anti-stress bath oil. So it's just a small little, small little bottle like this. And I believe it was one euro. Like currently these products are on offer, so really good prices. Like one euro, that's really inexpensive. And if I ever fancy a stress relieving bath. Hello, Louie, are you stressed? Oh, he's so cute. He'll jump on. And then I got this bath oil. Uh, they had a three different ones I believe they had one with like ginger and like very Christmassy smelling one but I'm not a huge fan of like ginger so I smelled this one and it smells amazing so it has argan marula um, ritzin oil and olive oil my boyfriend is texting me and this just smells very warm and comforting and the kind of smell that I love so cannot wait to try it out and you get a lot so this one was four euros four euros something really good price in my opinion cannot wait to try it so this is the book that i got i wanted to get it for like a year now it's by giovanni boccaccio and it's called the cameron it's a famous classic piece of literature and this edition is just the most beautiful edition i've ever seen look at that it's all gold and like shimmery and it's pretty inexpensive it's 15 euros i mean in my opinion it's inexpensive because it's a huge book like classic literature and such a stunning edition and it's like a present to myself and it will look incredible on my bookshelf and it's basically stories um of italian people and it's set in florence and um yeah i, I will mention it in a book haul probably but yeah, I wanted to get it for a long time and English edition is not as beautiful so I'm glad I got it in Lithuanian because it's stunning. Then I went to Alan Deco, I got this bowl. I've been eyeing this one for ages and I never really got it but I finally caved in and I got it. It's so pretty, look it's a minty bowl and then it's white and has these minty flowers and I thought it was gonna be perfect for guacamole and it's just cute it's just oh, i don't know i love it and then this was a very random and spontaneous purchase well as everything else so this one was three euros 75 cents pretty inexpensive if you ask me and then i got this picture frame it's a new um new item i never saw it in the shop before and i thought it's so stunning it's like a bunch of feathers like how gorgeous is this frame i just absolutely love it and it's gonna um fit in my room perfectly all of, all of these um picture frames are from alan deco and i love them so not sure where i'm gonna put this one maybe in the the bookshelf or my desk i don't know but it's gorgeous and it was really inexpensive it was seven euros that's a really good price in my opinion okay now i'm gonna show you what I got food wise, so I got baguette. You cannot beat Paris out of me. I'm so Parisian right now, cannot be without my baguette. I don't know, I just love baguette and I was craving it. I got this little pet mat for Louis. It's just a cute little pet mat, it was only two euros. He loves to sleep on the sofa downstairs in my mom's like office. And uh, uh, he has a blanket there, but it's like really old ugly blanket. So I thought I'm gonna put this cute one down there because he always sleeps there That's for you Lee. You can sniff <laughs> this one. I got these um, Baking cups for cupcakes because these look like a really simple raw and just I don't know like or organic I really like these and they were like 99 cents. I got some bread I got this melon. Look at how cute it is. This is gonna be perfect for me because I'm home alone for like the whole week almost. Um, this is gonna be enough for me and this is what I'm gonna have tonight. I'm gonna make some salad and then I'm gonna have this little melon as a treat. I got my favorite bread. I eat this every single morning. It's Batos, like um, 
you know, white bread for toasting with lots of like seeds. I just love it. I got two yogurts because for some reason I was craving yogurt with granola. I haven't had this for like a year or something. I was obsessed with having yogurt with granola every single day, but then I got so sick of it and I didn't have it for like a year now, but I was craving it today. So I bought myself some like granola and then um, mango yogurt and a strawberry yogurt from Alma. I got some cream cheese for, you know, making pasta or just, you know, having some of it on baguette. I love my cheese. I got this huge pack of Rocket because I can eat a lot of it with everything for every meal. I got some feta cheese because I think I'm gonna have the exact same salad that I had today before leaving the house. Uh, just Rocket, feta, olive oil, salt and pepper, lots of lemon, tuna. I got this tuna that I really like, so I always buy this Sun and Sea tuna. So I get it usually either in uh, its brine or this one is in olive oil, so I got two. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna have the salad with tuna and then what else do I add? Um, and then red onions as well. I got myself my favorite tea, well, one of my favorite teas. It's Milky Oolong by Greenfield. They're having 30% off currently. And um, yeah, I'm like halfway done through the pack. So I thought I'm gonna get a backup. I love Milky Oolong tea and it was gone for a while from the shops, but it's back again, back in stock. So I'm very happy about that. And then I got myself four mom stripes. These are raspberry ones because yeah, I need my candy. So yeah, that's everything I got today. Uh, didn't intend on shopping, obviously. Went just for a browse, but ended up buying a ton of stuff. So now I'm gonna go make myself some salad with baguette and then have a little bit of melon. Look at that, it's so cute. I love little white cats. And then these are seriously the best sweatpants I've owned in a long while. They're just so soft and comfy. This is the salad I described to you guys, so I'm not gonna tell you one more time what I'm, what I put in it. And here's uh, half of the melon, and then a huge piece of baguette. If you look past that, it's pretty healthy. So now I'm gonna eat all of that while skyping with my boyfriend. I feel like burning a candle tonight. So I have this candle from last year. It's by Spas, and it's their festive cookies candle. So it's probably gonna smell very Christmassy. Let me smell it. Mmm, it just smells, yeah, it does smell very Christmassy. It smells like spicy cookies. Looks so nice. I love three wick candles. So. That's gonna be pretty much it for this vlog. I'm just gonna catch up on Sunbeam's Jess vlogs. She just uploaded a new one of October day three, so I'm gonna watch that. So I just, I love her vlog so, so much. So that's her on my screen. And after that, before sleeping, I'm gonna read uh, my Harry Potter book. I'm currently reading the Goblet of Fire. I just started reading it yesterday, so I'm only 30 pages in. Uh, a long way to go because this one is 636 pages. 